Now I've already prepared my canvas. I just painted a black acrylic over the square canvas. Had to crop the picture that you're going to see appear over here to the right that I'm going to be working off of. It's a graphite and as you can see it will um, leave a mark of some kind on the uh, canvas but not quite uh, profound enough that I would like. So I'm just going to use a white colored pencil to do the drawing. And to start out, what I what I truly suggest to do is just to map out on the on the on here some some points you can you can use um a grid if you want but just to kind of figure out the the proportions of your character um by using some delineation marks and to know where his uh lightsaber should be um in, in proximity to him, okay? We're gonna lose some of this lightsaber here, actually. Um, and uh, it's okay, because that's gonna happen. Now, if you make a mistake on your angle, just adjust the paint's gonna go over this at any rate. Um, it looks like this actually lightsaber is more at a other, so probably about right there. So let's go ahead and uh, just kind of pencil in the proximate location of the lightsaber. Probably that'll be about where the end of it goes. Might be a little bit further up. So we'll have to come back to that. I, I would say to just got, kind of get an idea of where this lightsaber is going to be approximately right there we'll paint over that that's fine but what we need to do is first start I think best thing to do is just start with the uh, oval um, of the face you want to start with the um, shoulder line proximate you can just use some basic lines just to show where things are at and then because he's got like a uh, uh, almost a triangle your triangular figure with his helmet um, this is just giving me an indication of where things are at you can you see that his body has a V shape sort of at the top and not quite so tapered uh, he has a midsection approximately right there and then of course um, as we go in to his bottom part of his body almost looks wider than his top. Man, this guy's got some big hips. <laughs> so just kind of penciling in with the midsection approximately where the belt's going to be, approximately where the, the arms are going to be. I'm just anatomically um, taking some lines on here. It's just, just something that you can do to um, penciling your figure just so that you're using the stick fig, the basic stick figure to start. And that's that's just that's just a starting point, okay? About where his hands are compared to the rest of his body. Okay, so that's that's the basic starting point. And I'm gonna go ahead and time lapse the rest and we'll draw and I'll just voice over all that. <laughs>
heard everybody. Um, that's just the sketch, okay? This is not meant to be a detailed drawing. It's to get me a layout on the canvas, okay? And then the paint does a lot of the work. I think what we'll do is just do like a blue, bl bluish uh, blur behind, maybe add in a little bit of the, uh, what looks like trees behind them. Um, we might be able to put in a little bit of that snow falling. Uh, but I think what's going to come out really cool is the uh, red reflection from the lightsaber. Um, we'll use oil paints. We're going to use oil paints. Uh, the luminescence, I think, from the red is going to be real neat. And um, so this is just part one. Next video, you'll see me painting them. This is just the sketch. So this is just a how to draw Kylo Ren or how to draw Star Wars Fortnite event Kylo ran from the how they how they posed him for Fortnite because that's where I'm getting my image from so I hope you enjoyed please like please subscribe please share tell everybody about us uh, again if you want a channel just to give you ideas of what to paint or to help learn some drawing techniques or to help learn uh, painting techniques this is a great channel for you to watch um, and subscribe to so please don't you know make sure you hit that bell there get the notes for my next video that way you can see when the painting video of uh, this one comes up y'all have a great weekend have a great week be safe out there see you next time